I'm about to show you how to bold, italicize, and format your font in different ways across Facebook, Messenger, and email subject lines. Now this is a really cool hack that you're going to want to pay attention to because when I discovered this hack, I not only used it across all the different ways I just mentioned, but I was super excited to use it because I knew for a fact that it was going to increase my performance in my Facebook ads, in my organic Facebook posts, in my messenger blasts, in my email open rates and click rates. So you definitely want to be using this little hack that I'm about to show you. So stay tuned and let's go ahead and jump into it. All right, so before we jump into it, I have got to tell you about these two really cool things that you have got to pick up. They're completely free. Basically, I have a free internet marketing course where I teach you click funnels, Facebook ads, I teach you copywriting, how to write copy for social media, for email, blog posts, all that kind of stuff. I have a completely free course and I have a completely free mini chat messenger bot cheat sheet. Now, if you want to get these two completely free things, all you got to do is go to freebosslifestyle.com. I'll have it right here freebosslifestyle.com that's going to get you access to the two things now the mini chat cheat sheet is called the 11 crucial features that your mini chat messenger bot must have a lot of people are loving this thing it comes with a pdf download and a video walkthrough because if you're like me and you're not a big PDF reader or reader in general then you got the video walkthrough where I just walk you through the whole thing and I explain the whole thing to you and then in the course, it is a course built in ClickFunnels that's completely free. And the way you get both of them is through Facebook Messenger. You gotta click the buttons on the actual landing page. That's gonna send you a message. And then you go through those steps and you can get access to both of these two things. Completely free, very high value, incredible stuff. I highly recommend you go over to freebosslifestyle.com right after you watch this video. So now let's go ahead and jump into this tutorial where I show you how to format your text, you, you bold it, you italicize it, you got all these different options that you can do. So let's go ahead and show you this now. I am in here in a website that has a really weird URL. I typed it right here. It's https cas.wtf slash use slash convert CGI. Anyway, I'm going to put the link in the description. So check in the description for this exact link. There's a bunch of these different kind of sites. This is the best one that I found. Basically what it is, is it's a Unicode text converter. So what, what I typically do is I will go and I'll type in my Facebook ad copy, get it looking as best as possible. And then I will highlight and copy whatever parts of that Facebook ad that I either want to bold, I want to italicize, maybe I want to bold and italicize it. Maybe I just want to do some weird things that they offer with this site so I'll, I'll copy that I'll paste it into this bar this little input bar right here I'll click show so let me go ahead and show you I'll just walk you through the process right now so I'm here in the ads manager and I'm just gonna type in um, how to run a Facebook ad all right so that's the copy it doesn't really have to be typed into this actual ad box. I just like to lay it out because that's what I'm used to. And then when I'm pretty much, I got the ad set at, at a good place. Then I copy that text right there. I come over here to this Unicode text converter site, paste it into that, hit the show button, and it's going to show me all these different ways that they have written that copy. Now I typically just stick to this top part up here. It's either going to be math sans bold or just math bold. I typically like to go with math bold. Uh, if I'm doing like a testimonial, like a review, then I'll go with like an italicized thing and then I'll usually bold their name. So you can really switch up however you really want to. But um, basically you're, wanna, you're gonna wanna highlight that copy right there, come back to the Facebook Ads Manager and then paste it right there. Now you can see in the preview, now it's bold. And that is freaking awesome because it works across all these different platforms. Um, this is just a Facebook ads manager. When you hit publish, it's going to actually show up in people's feeds bold like that, which is awesome. It's going to grab more attention that way because it's different than what people are seeing and people will just be scrolling and be like, whoa, I'm not used to seeing bold or italicized fonts up in Facebook. So I highly recommend you use it and you're probably going to use it because you're watching this video, but it's super cool. Okay. So that's Facebook. If I wanted to do it inside many chat, inside messenger bot type of stuff, then you just come into your messenger and you just paste it in there and it will actually be bolded like that. So it's really just as simple as highlighting your regular font, 
putting it into this Unicode text converter and then just copying. Now you got to copy it right here as they're showing it. Copy that and then paste it into wherever you really want right and it freaking shows up and it is incredible and then you can use your emojis and all that kind of stuff so that is how you do the actual little unicode text trick um, and another little hack that i'm going to share with you is just this little facebook hack that i recently came across basically it's, it's not really even a facebook hack it's just kind of a retargeting strategy but i call it the 555 little strategy. So what you want to do is you want to create a custom audience and this custom audience is going to be people who have engaged with your page within the last five days. Okay. Then you create an ad set and you target that audience spending $5 a day in that ad set. Now the spend is really going to vary depending on how many people have engaged with your page within the last five days. This could be a lot of people like this could be thousands of people if you have a very high traffic page. So in that case, you're probably going to want to spend more than $5 a day, but I make it $5 a day because it sounds catchy, right? Five, five, five. So anyway, you have an engagement audience, people who have engaged with your page, five uh, over the last five days and then you're spending five dollars a day in that ad set and then inside that ad set you have five different ads because what i have found is the way to do a very effective retargeting strategy is by using a variety of different ads if you are using the same ad to hit them over and over and over and they're seeing that same ad like 10 times they're just going to get annoyed they're just going to block your ads they're going to try and just escape because it's just annoying seeing the same crap over and over. You want to have variety with your ads. You want to have multiple ads hitting them over and over, different videos, different images. And that is what's going to build that trust, credibility, familiarity that we are trying to build to get people to turn into customers, to get people to opt in, to overall build that virtual relationship that we're trying to build online. So that is another little hack that I just wanted to share with you, another little strategy to test out. And that's pretty much it for this video. So thank you so much for watching this video. Go ahead and leave a comment, hit that like button. Let me know if you have any questions, if you have any ideas for future videos and you want me to make a video on something that you're just trying to figure out but you just can't figure out. Be sure that you visit freebosslifestyle.com. Get those two little freebies that I will have. All the links are going to be in the description. And thank you so, so much for watching and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.